Titration Curves of Amino Acids Titration is a method used to quantitatively determine the unknown concentration of an acid or base by neutralizing the acid or base by a known concentration of an acid or base. Titration curves are obtained when the pH of given volume of sample solution varies after consecutive addition of an acid or alkali. The curves are usually plots of pH versus the volume of titrant added. Amino acids are amphoteric molecules which can be titrated either against an acid or an alkali. They are weak polyprotic acids which exist as vitriones at neutral pH. When an aqueous solution of an amino acid is titrated with acid, it acts as a base and with a base it acts as an acid, which makes them amphoteric in nature. In this experiment, we will plot the titration curve of glycine and thereby calculate the pKa values of this amino acid. Materials required 0.1 molar hydrochloric acid 0.1 molar sodium hydroxide pH meter 0.1 molar glycine burette with burette stand stirrer Standard buffer labeled pH is equal to 4, pH is equal to 7, and pH is equal to 10. 50 ml beaker, measuring jar, still road, distilled water, and tissue paper. Procedure First, calibrate the pH meter using the standard pH buffer solution. Remove the cap of the pH electrode and wash the electrode with the distilled water. Now place the electrode back on the pH meter stand and wipe the bulb of the electrode using a tissue paper to remove the excess water. Now calibrate pH meter by clicking on the button labeled Cal on the instrument and dip the pH electrode into the standard buffer labeled pH is equal to 4. Note down the value displayed on the pH meter which should be around 4. Take out the pH electrode from the pH buffer labeled pH is equal to 4 and wash the electrode thoroughly with distilled water and wipe the electrode after placing it back on the stand. Repeat the same step while dipping the pH electrode into the standard buffer labeled pH is equal to 7 and pH is equal to 10 respectively. Now record the value displayed on the pH meter which is observed as 7 and 10. Now pip it out 20 ml of 0.1 molar glycine and transfer it into a 50 ml beaker. Keep the beaker containing 0.1 molar glycine on top of the stirrer and dip the pH electrode and the stir bar into the beaker. As stirring occurs, record the pH. Add 0.1 molar HCl into 50 ml burette and clamp the burette. Open the stop cock of the burette and slowly add aliquots of 0.3 ml HCl into the beaker containing 0.1 molar glycine. pH readings are noted after each addition of HCl till the pH value becomes 1.6. Now stop the stirring and remove the electrode from the stand. It should be washed thoroughly with the distilled water. Again transfer 20 ml of 0.1 molar glycine into a fresh 50 ml beaker and place it on top of the stirrer and record the pH. Now clamp the burette containing 0.1 molar NaOH to the stand and slowly add aliquots of 0.3 ml NaOH into the beaker containing 0.1 molar glycine. Note down the pH reading after each addition of NaOH till the pH reaches above 12. Finally, draw the titration curve using the values obtained from the experiment. Precautions Always clamp the electrode in order to avoid the bumping of stir bar with it during stirring. Make sure that the electrode is properly immersed in the beaker containing amino acid solution, otherwise the pH reading will be erratic. <laughs>